very important for consumers to you know, know about their system and work with their system to make the most out of it. I've certainly come across a lot of systems that have hardly ever worked because consumers don't know how to work around them. So that's, so that's a very good question, a very important part. Um, the, the most basic form is to basically turn your boiler on, your backup boiler on after the sun's gone down is, mm -hmm. is the very sort of starting point because what you want to do is make sure that the solar can make its contribution to your hot water mm -hmm. um, when in the daylight hours when the sun is shining. So you don't want to have your, your oil with your gas boiler on during mm -hmm. the, 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 the daytime if possible. Um, it's very important that um, whenever we're designing the systems, as you can see from the tank, the, the solar coil and, and the, this is the backup sort of um, traditional heating coil are at different levels in the tank. Mm -hmm. So it's very important when you're designing the system that the tank is designed correctly so you can get the best out of it even using both systems at the same time. Um, this is obviously a very small demonstration tank, they'd normally be much taller and thinner. Uh, uh, sorry, not much thinner but much taller. Yeah. Um, and basically that's designed so you can use your backup heating and it's not going to disrupt too much the solar which can still make a contribution at the bottom. Mm -hmm with um, actually timing your heating and make, getting the most out of the solar it's certainly as I say, using the, the, your backup boiler system after the sun's gone down um, making sure that the, your solar controller will basically tell you the temperature in your tank mm -hmm. so a lot of the customers who, who get the best benefits out of their systems actually consult their solar controller before they ever use their, their, their backup boiler mm -hmm. so they can see how much hot water they've got before turning on their, their other you know, fuel source um, and, and not using it at all in, in case they don't need it. So it, it's generally setting the timings on your, uh, on mm -hmm. your hot water to, to ensure that the solar gets first cool on it.